Hey guys, Packin here. What I have with me today is my Saberforge um, package that came to me today, and today is now August 20, uh, August 13, and uh, I ordered this back on June 26. So it does take a, at least about a month and 13 days um, to receive it. Uh, so far, um, this is a uh, this is a regular box. I'm doing a very quick unboxing video and I will show you. As you can see, it is sealed. Not has never been tampered with. Boxes sealed up. And uh, let us check inside. All right. So this is just an empty hilt um, that I got um, when they ha were having a sale. So I was lucky enough to uh, obtain it. All right. There we go. All right. As you can see that the Use a brown paper bag for protection and they use bubble wrap along with a layer of cardboard paper, um, brown paper. And there's nothing left. Okay, put that aside. Uh, so far, I like how they package the hilts um, bubble wrap with a uh, USPS priority box, um, standard shoe box. And it's a very much a preferred method for any one chipping uh, package, if the package tilts. And here you go. Oh man. It comes with a note. They stand by their uh, warranty. Uh, these hilts are um, all machine metal parts offer a lifetime warranty for manufacturer defects. Um, Saberforge um, has a really great hilt selection. So when you order a hilt, you get a, a lifetime warranty with them um, only for the hilts. Uh, so that is, it also comes with a Saberforge business card as well as my invoice oh it comes with allen key that's awesome and so far I see no issues with this hilt oh man it feels warm to the touch these buttons seems to be affixed in place I heard these are going to be very difficult to get out, so it's going to take a lot of manpower to remove these. All right, let's uh, let's put the bubble wrap back in, and I'm going to use my scalpel tool and. There you go. Just take your time with it. You don't want to scratch the hilt. Okay. Oh. Awesome, thank you. There are no imperfections I can find from this hilt. It is beautifully machined by Cyberforge. Uh, this is a an exclusive uh, discontinued uh, Saberforge Destiny, which is modeled after a uh, a Kiana statue, a Japanese statue. Um, I'm not sure what uh, companies are called, but it is modeled after that specific uh, toy line um, for the Kiana Solo. Uh, I, I I love this hilt. It's very simple, uh, very elegant. 
All right. Let's take a closer look. All right, let me see. It seems that that the finish from top to bottom appears to be media blasted. As you can see, the grooves had these little bumps, so these probably were media blasted, then anodized. So this is originally media blasted, originally, then it's anodized in black, then they sanded this whole thing down to be nice and smooth, as you can tell from the brushed uh, look. And it comes with a awesome um, blade plug. All right, Saber Forge, this is a high quality hilt. I enjoy it and it fits in my hand perfectly. Um, this is gonna be used for um, one of my private collections. I love to actually own a Gianna Solo from the Expanded Universe. And uh, it's really too bad. You don't see a lot of these um, being offered by Saber Forge anymore. And oh, these are threaded. Like that. Oh, it's pretty long, look at that. So it's pretty long from here. That's media blast at the bottom, it's all black. It's nice and hollow. As you can tell from the pommel, you notice that these have individual uh, V-shaped grooves. <laughs> this may take a while to do, you know, just do this, um, make a groove line here, and then they machined it uh, perfectly, making, making this more unique, rather than having it a uh, square shape, it's more uh, tapered down at the pommel. That's a pretty unique look. And also put a nice groove on the ring, on the rim of the emitter. So it's not just the outside, it's also here as well, in a nice little control box. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Packing, signing off. Peace.